Hey, David. Hey, what's up, Gio? What's up? How are you? I'm fine. What's the correct way to answer that? Fine or good? Or... Oh, there's many ways. Um, I'm fine. I'm all right. It's all yeah. good. Mm -hmm. I'm hanging. I'm hanging okay. in there. Yeah. Like that. I'm hanging there. I'm hanging there. Hanging in there. I'm hanging in there. Hanging in there. Okay. There's um. There's a way that men, a man, ask another man. You know, how are they hanging? Yeah. Hey, that looks like, like a tremolo. This. You yeah. know, I'm trying. I I don't know. I'm trying to find out what this is for. It's like a tremolo. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. That is a little large, but it yeah. looks like a tremolo, a guitar Every, tremolo. <laughs> yeah, this is like this is like my studio, right? I have my computer and my tools and everything here. And every every time I come, there's always something broken or or something new. My son always comes in. Hi, Mister Knight. What's up, Eduardo? Hi. Also, you're talking about the highs. There is always saying that that say, for example, hey. Hey, 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 what you been up to? That is all you say, that is all you mean? Yeah, actually, the, the correct way is, I mean, what have you been up to? Uh, but if you? It, it's what have you been up to, but people yeah. say it fastly, you know, like, yeah. so what, what you been up to? Yeah, exactly. That's what I hear. From a man to another man, you can say, how are they hanging? Okay. Do you understand the expression? How are they hanging? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> or, or, or also, uh, what's going on? Yeah, what's going on? What's up? Yeah. What's going on? What's going on? What's yeah. up? That That's like a slang English, isn't it? Yeah. Yes, I mean, the correct way would be, the formal would be, how are you? Yeah. How's it going? Okay. How do you do? Yeah. How do you do? That's another one. But that's like extremely, um, extremely formal. Hi, how do you do? Okay, it's, it's very formal. Yes, it's very, very formal. There's a cool song from Radiohead, it's called How Do You Do, it's good. Hey, any good music lately, Giovanni, that you live, you've been listening to? Uh, I don't know. You if it good, but it sounds good for me. <laughs> hmm. I found this band named Vitriol. It's a very heavy oh, really? technique, oh. that band, that metal band. Yeah. More than Marduk? Yeah, very, very technique and more, yeah, I, I think so, yeah. Oh man, I, I've been going backwards because <laughs> Lately, I mean, my preference is rock. I like from the heaviest to anything, but lately I've been listening a lot, a lot to this band, um, Arcade Fire. And I mean, the first time you listen to them, have you ever heard Arcade Fire? No. They're like an indie rock band, but they're not pop, but, but it's like... It's like you're listening to the patch mode, Queen. I like the patch mode. Yeah, it's like you're listening to the the patch mode, NXS Queen. It's like you're listening to a lot of '80s bands because mm -hmm. um, they're really talented. And every time you watch their videos, it's like the girl she's playing the piano, and then she's playing the drums, and you never know who's playing what. And they use mm -hmm. a lot of. I'll send you some videos, man. They they have good music. If you see them in, in the musically point of view, they have a lot of like good sounds. Okay. okay. Yeah, they're, they're kind of cool. They're, they're arcade fire. Um, hey, what's up, Ricardo? How are you? What do you do? Ricardo, what is do that, you do, Ricardo? How do you do, Ricardo? <laughs> is that your house in the back? <laughs> yes, in the exhibition. <laughs> <laughs> it's your beach house. Yes, yeah. the beach beach house. <laughs> but it's a, a, a good night because it's not not very hot, but uh, it's a 
um, uh, it's uh, not, not very hot to, to, today. It's a uh, good night for me in Lupango. <laughs> Well, it's not, it's not what? It's, it's hot or it's cool? No, it's um, warm, warm, I think. It's no, no, not, no, not too hot uh, in this moment. Oh, okay. So it's cool. It's cool. Yes. Cool, um, like, like we, the air conditioning, uh, cool. Yes. A little windy. Because uh, it, it is uh, like a, a, the, the weather in my, my neighborhood is like a, 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 a desert, desert because uh, it's a, a windy and hot in the day, but at night it's a, a, a cool. But you work with AC all day, right? AC, yes. Uh, in, 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 and the AC, I, 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 I have an AC. In, in your office, in, in, in your work? Uh, in, in my home, it's only in the, my room for, for, for to, uh, to sleep. In this moment, in this office, it's the office for home. It's, no, 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 it's only for a fan. Oh, OK. Yeah, that's why that's why I sleep in separate rooms with my wife. Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes, because I want air conditioning. She doesn't like it. A mm -hmm. fan, she doesn't like it. A TV, she doesn't like it. She, my wife is like a. Your opposite. Yeah, <laughs> but she she's and that's how my son is, man. They're like vampires, you know, like when they. <laughs> yeah, I mean, they can literally go to the bed and say good night and uh, and just sleep. Wow! In total <laughs> silent, and I mean, silent, no light and darkness, everything. I can't. Never in my life. I mean, <laughs> I need to watch TV or or watch my phone. You know, watch videos and go to sleep like that. <laughs> I was like that before. But my my wife changed me. Well, how are you like like my like, wife like, or like me? Yeah, like your wife. Really? And now I'm like you. <laughs> okay. Yeah. 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 You know, like we don't have. I mean, well, because now, um, since we have an extra room, I I always go to the extra room. That's where I sleep, and I have a TV, I have a fan, and everything. And um, it's better like that. Yeah, I like watching TV. I, li I like noise. I like noise when when um before I go to sleep. Yeah. So how is everyone? Everything okay? Any anything new? Politics sucks so far. There's no good news. Mm -hmm. No, there's no drama. There's no new drama. No, I haven't heard yeah. about it. Any, any. The soap opera is in 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 standby. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Until September. Yeah. <laughs> when, yeah. When the Bitcoin thing starts. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, but I honestly. Yeah. They, they, they change the Bitcoin. <laughs> no, it, that, not, nothing gonna happen. I, I was in a webinar with the, this guy, is a teacher from Inkai. I don't know if you, if you know what Inkai is. No, no. It's like a. It, it's like a high education institute uh, for uh, like phd or something mm -hmm. Ma maestria i don't know how to say maestria a okay. master's master thank you so a master. masters so, masters it's like in plural. Yeah. okay thanks oh uh, this guy said that bitcoin it is not made for be used like the government think that we are going to use them use it so it is not uh viable it is not possible it it's it is not a a, a like a, a a normal currency a normal coin so i think uh, we don't have anything to worry about the bitcoin but which is coming uh, later it's 
what is what could be uh, uh, dangerous you know uh, the rumor about the dollar column uh, like a new currency for the salvador that could be dangerous but not the bitcoin yeah mm -hmm. i i don't think i don't think it will be an obligation like as an, a currency an obligation it, it, i hope i hope because if it is i will be very angry and i would really speak against the government but uh -huh. if not i was speaking with some googlers um because remember i told you i worked in google yeah. and a lot of googlers well, a lot of people in, in 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 silicon valley well listen to our culture did you hear the, the chat that Nayib Bukele had on, on Twitter? Did you see that? Um, I don't when think he so. spoke. You see, that's the sad part about our culture. Um, he was actually speaking, I, but this was when he announced that um, when he announced that he was going to be in, he was going to make the, the Bitcoin. Mm -hmm. You can check it out. It, you know that I don't know how many thousands of people he had, and he pretty much had like all the college and university students, economy students, and everybody was in that chat and they were speaking with him and he was answering their questions. And everybody was so amazed, like, oh my God. Like a lot of people from, from the Silicon Valley where Google is. Now we get a lot of talk. Hey, what are you guys are going to do with the Bitcoin, with the Bitcoin? You see, I mean, there's always two ways of seeing this thing, right? <laughs> we see it. I mean, in El Salvador, it's different because we're we're a poor country, and uh, in the United States, it's cool because you can go and buy your coffee and just put your telephone on on you know, and, and that's it. So, I personally, I don't know if El Salvador is ready for the Bitcoin technology yeah, not, wise we speaking. Are not ready. But yeah. I don't know if it's really also if it's really a bad idea. Because like what Bukele said, if he says it's not an obligation, if you don't want to, don't use it. Okay. I hope it's like that. What what my boss was telling me in Google is that, and it's true, he said, Jaime's not, I'm going to speak before Jaime comes in. <laughs> no, I'm joking. He said, you know what, David? What I think is, I think how the benefit, that, like the benefit about the Bitcoin in El Salvador is not that we're going to get richer or poorer. We're not. That's really not going to affect us. The only benefit that could happen is that people invest in El Salvador. That's it. Because they are trillionaires, trillionaires in the world that have Bitcoin. And if they know there is a country that exists, that the Bitcoin is a legal currency, they will want to invest. And I was thinking, um, I, I didn't know about that, you know. Yeah. And, so. you know, investment brings a company, company brings employee employment. Oh. Yes, but employment, not very well paid, but on modo. I mean. <laughs> but uh, if the situation was like you said, I think, another country more developed than El Salvador should have that uh, currency. I asked I asked my boss that. But we I are asked the him, first one. I asked him and, and I asked him how come how come like Japan or China exactly. or, he says because they don't need to their currency is already why why would they want to it's like because we are dollar our currency is dollar mm -hmm. but really we're colones still <laughs> Yeah. It's, it's not our currency. It's the United States currency. But he tells me like, um, but a lot, all the countries in Europe, they do have, you can pay with Bitcoins. No, but what he told me is that why, why if, if the pound is higher than the dollar, then why are you going to um, manipulate it and maybe ruin it with the Bitcoin? So I don't know. It's going to be very interesting. I, I don't know. Sometimes I think it's good. Sometimes I think it's bad, but it's going to be very interesting. But one thing I do tell you is I will take those 30 Bitcoins. <laughs> and I'm going well, to you buy will me... give all your personal information to the government. But they already have they it. They already have it. Yeah. yeah. They yeah. already have. <laughs> they... I won't take that. Have you ever opened an app in your in your phone? Yeah, and they when have I have you ever something... have you ever read all the all the yeah. laws 
Oh, okay. I say I do. <laughs> exactly. Do you know that? You? Do you know why apps are free? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yep, I know. Do you that. know that that's know. why that's why they always ask you permission like hey I want to take a picture do you allow this app to go into your archive Yeah do you know that even if you download Angry Birds they have access to all your phone to your camera they can even look in your camera you're giving them access So really I, that that when people say oh you're giving all your information to the government Bukele lo dijo we already have it don't worry <laughs> I remember he, yeah. he said it in the United States a lot of people said that like it's funny because people are saying that and they have WhatsApp they have Facebook Where? they have FaceTime Where? have you ever have you ever been talking about something and then suddenly it pops up in YouTube yeah that happened to me or in this or Facebook I say I want to buy a shoe yeah then the shoe or I want up. to buy an umbrella and suddenly I have a lot of uh, advertisement uh, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, about an, an umbrella. <laughs> when I was working in Dell, and I'm telling you this like 15 years ago, I was working in Dell and they told us, please, because we would speak with people from the United States and they say, please, ni por chiste, yeah, or try not to, please don't mention the president's name don't mention bomb or any any words any words that um that could be suspicious and we ask why because the cia the central Intel intelligence agency of the united states they don't listen to your calls because there's too many calls they would have to pay five million employees to be listening to call after call after call. So they have like this smart system. Like all the calls are being recorded, but if somebody says bomb, Obama, boom, boom, those, esas silla pasan como red flags. They still don't mean as dangerous because I can, I can may, maybe make a joke. Y Donald Trump, hay una que elijo Donald Trump a la bomba. You know, okay, whatever, blah, blah, blah. It was a simple joke, but they will listen to that call. Can you imagine that? Was that it, the, the system detects keywords. Like it's a filter, yeah. They, and then they will start listening to you, listening to you. Did you ever see the, the TV show, The Good Wife? Yeah. No. Yeah. Remember they did that? They, had, they actually had the agency. They listened to your calls. They listened to everything yeah yeah so i i think they already i mean they already have all our information they know what we do bueno there was a there was a a picture a long time ago mark mark Zuckerberg. do you know who mark Zuckerberg is the facebook owner yeah he's facebook. a very good friend of mine um <laughs> <laughs> he took a selfie i don't know what he was doing or he i don't know like a, we hit 100 million people in Facebook. And do you know that when he took the picture, it was him in his laptop and he put um, Avia on Tiro in, in the camera. Yeah, I, I do that. <laughs> yeah, I do that. Too. I mean, yeah, yeah. I, after after I work there, yeah, I do that. Like, when, you know, sometimes you're in the bathroom watching videos, like, uh oh, no, lo voy a poner. <laughs> yeah or with a marker huh yeah imagine the people that work on that mira este. <laughs> by any chance have you ever seen the, a, a movie in netflix called the social dilemma mm -hmm. yeah no i haven't it's a good uh, i do yeah it's really it's a movie it's a movie it's a movie yeah, it, yeah. it's like a, a documental uh, it, it is not like a movie uh, with actors, but uh, you 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 have people who work in Instagram, Google, uh, Twitter, uh, every uh, Silicon Valley uh, company, and they talk about the business behind the the the, the service that the, the app offers to you, and it's it's really it's weird. I mean, what they do with your information is really. Uh, yeah, you know, and and also what my boss was telling me in Google, he said, you see, David, 
he said he told me i don't know if your president is crazy or he has like really really good uh mm -hmm. assessing as you know people assessing uh, assisting him assessors assessors because assassins. yeah assassins assassins, no, uh, assessors <laughs> and he says because advisors that, probably Mm. No assessors too. You can say okay, assessors. Okay. Assessors. Uh, the the thing is that he he was telling me that he he was comparing them like to the president of Canada. The difference between the millennium presidents, like like when the the difference between the young politicians to the old ones. Like for example, the president of United States, come on, Biden, he's seventy something. And you said, really, man, we really need a seventy year old person controlling maybe the biggest country in the world the most important country in the world and then or or like in El Salvador it's always been the same politicians forever I mean Arena Ghana uh, FMLN wins it's going to be the same politicians anyway so he was saying about the 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 millennium and he says one thing that they don't understand and I never I never stopped to think about that he told me look Look how the companies work today. Uber. Uber is a transportation company, right? Yeah. And they don't have cars. Amazon. Amazon is a company that delivers, and they don't even make products. They don't have stores, I think. They don't. <laughs> you know, and you know, like everything is changing. That's the mentality of the new millenniums, like or like people with. I'm going to invest here because like in the 80s, I'm going to invest in Uber. And a person from the 80s, maybe in Uber, his idea would be I'm going to buy 10,000 cars in every country. Yeah, told about by poner Uber. But no, with the new millennium, he says, I want a transportation, but I don't want cars. So he used technology. Yeah, for the, just for the service. Just, just like the uh, service. It, it, just like Airbnb, for example. Airbnb, it, yes. It, pretty much the same you know and 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 it's true so like he was and not only the bitcoin there's like four different type of in the united states the yeah, a right. lot of people use there's like four different currency hay otra como que se llama dot coin uh, ethereum um, yeah ethereum yeah there is a bunch and uh, there is a more than 500 i think because it is not uh, difficult uh, to to make a a digital a currency. A big, yeah. a, a digital I'm going currency. to get I'm going to get my thirty my thirty bitcoins. <laughs> I'm going to go super selectos and buy myself a litro de harana tequila. <laughs> and then say, "Mi primer brindis, thank you, Bukele, And never again will I see bitcoins again in my life. I really. But only if the selector <laughs> has the prices at, in bitcoins. Otherwise. No, that, that's can. the next, that's the other thing I want to find out how that's going to be. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> because if he says that many people thought that, okay, we have the 30 bitcoins and I will get $30, $30 but no, he yep. said you can get dollars. You can spend that bitcoins in bitcoins. Yeah, oh. I know. Oh, I know. yes, he's going to give us 30 bitcoins. That would be an equivalent. Oh, I want 30 bitcoins. <laughs> it no, no, it's not 30 right. bitcoins. He's going to give an equivalent of $30 yeah. in bitcoins. In bitcoins, I, yeah. I, but you I, can't I, change it with dollars. Dollar, exactly. For dollars, you only you, can you can't. for bitcoin. Yeah. You can't. Uh -huh. the small part only of with the, bitcoins. Oh, mm -hmm. with bitcoin. The small part of the bitcoin, it's called Satoshi. But oh, Satoshi. Yeah. It's a oh, because yeah. a big one bitcoin is right now uh 43 thousand dollars oh really yep okay oh my god i have five bitcoins oh my god <laughs> almost a quarter million dollars baby <laughs> <Hey>, my friend <laughs> did you see that meme of of of, of sanchez seren Huh? You know that in ultimo one well, member Sanchez Seren, he, and he was like, "Did you hear that? Can Nayib nos quiere dolarizar?" <laughs> <laughs> Imagine he's so old and so stupid that he thinks we still live in Colonia. So for him, <laughs> it was, oh my God, nos quiere dolarizar. Yeah, poor guy. Yeah, he's happy now in at Nicaragua. He's mm. not so stupid as people thought. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> 
Do you watch? Do you watch um, YouTubers? Have you ever watched Gabriel Herrera? Oh no. No, I don't know. Uh, he's he, 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 he because I I got I got I, I got tired of Luisito man. I mean, at the beginning I liked him, but now he's boring. I mean, it's the same thing. Now he's only like with his girlfriend. Oh my god, I'm here with my girlfriend. I'm here with my girlfriend. But what I'm telling you is like Luis, uh, this guy Gabriel Herrera. He's from. Um, Venezuela and I was watching once yesterday he actually went to like the there's a Mercado Libre something like marketplace mm -hmm. Los Precios de las Casas oh man like like Santa Elena type of houses $20,000 in in Venezuela mid class mid class $1,000 $2,000 yeah. yeah, and then you know he he um he did a very he does like three or four videos. You know he went to the supermarket, he went to the street everywhere, and I was telling my wife I don't understand. Imagine that beautiful house twenty thousand dollars. What about all the people from FMLN that stole millions? Why don't they go to Venezuela and just buy a building? <laughs> mm -hmm. But they're smart because they know that. I don't know, maybe Maduro someday he will disappear and or like a, a revolution could happen. But they go to Nicaragua. <laughs> I would I if 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 Venezuela wasn't so bad, I would go live there. Leave him a posa. Vaya. Imaginate. Mid class is one thousand, two thousand dollars. Te voy a comprar una casa media clase baja. Four hundred dollars. <laughs> Te voy a comprar oh, todo, vaya, yeah. para que no veas que soy malo. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you should watch him. He's good. He's good. All right. Hey, Jaime, you're back. Hi. Jaime, you always look angry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, not really. I'm not angry. You're not I, angry. You are, you are, you are, you are <laughs> so, so happy to to discussing about, about Venezuela. I don't know. This is a good day. Uh, Country, no? For you? All I know <laughs> is that Venezuela has very beautiful women. Yes. Ah, yeah. <laughs> really? Yes, oh, yes. You never saw Las Telenovelas, man? <laughs> no, did you ever see that show? Que locura. Margarita oh, Island. Man, you, you know, you, you know, yes, you're visiting Margarita Island. Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. Yes. yes. <clears throat> hello, 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 hello. Oh, hello, hello. Yeah. I hear you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we hear you. Hello, can you hear me? Yes. Yeah, I can hear yes. you. But yes, sir. Yeah. Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. yes. Thank you. Sorry about that. I thought I yeah. lost. You. Yeah, Venezuela has very beautiful women. All right. Uh let's 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 do this listening. Aaron's son wanted to keep the wallet and spend the money. Have you ever have you ever found money? Mm, no, never. I do. Where? How, well, how much? Please don't say two dollars. I mean, I mean, like that's good. Ten dollars in my pocket. <laughs> a good significant amount of money. Have you ever found it? No. No. Uh, no. no. Five dollars. When I was a kid, I found two hundred colones, and I, it it was a bunch of money. That yeah. 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 It still is today. Is so more than twenty dollars. Yeah. yeah. What did you do? Let me guess. You gave it to your mother. Uh no. No, I, I spent the money in candies, uh, uh, toys for my brothers, and um, how do you say ice cream? But did you tell your parents? Yes, I told them, and they uh, said, they "Oh, let, really? They let you keep the money?" Yes, yes, yes. Oh, that's so cool. My parents would have taken it. Give me that money. You're not ready for this. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you got cool parents. Or I got bad parents. Yeah. <laughs> or or I have bad parents. <laughs> it's one of the two. It depends. 
No, you know, once I, I found a wallet with, I think it was like $380 inside oh, with wow. everything. I mean, I mean, somebody, I walked in and it was in CESA building. No, CESA. Holsey was today, the one by, um, yeah, and the, the wallet was <clears throat> in the top of the toilet of the lid. Do you know what wow. is a lid? Yeah. Yep. So I think that person left and then he, you know, and here comes me, right? And I saw it. <clears throat> and I, oh my God. <laughs> but, you know, I said, this is too good to be true. This person is going to come immediately. Like, I had the wallet. I put the wallet. I washed my hands. Nobody came in. So I remember I spoke with the receptionist and I, and I asked her, like, excuse me, can I speak with the manager? And, you know, she says, yeah, yeah, you know. Listen, I found this wallet. Because I wasn't going to leave it with the receptionist, you know. So the player, oh, see, I said, oh, thank you. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then the receptionist can just say, fiesta kids. Así le encontraron. Sin dinero. Well, the thing is, I never knew what happened, but um, the temptation, you know, that what if? What if? And, you know, and I felt so bad the whole day and I was telling people, but, you know, people were telling me, no, you did something good. You should feel happy, you know, proud. And I said, then why do I feel sad? <laughs> <laughs> you know, and then, you know, God will pay you. God will pay you. Okay. That week they stole my battery. My tire popped. And wow. I remember I was telling my, my girlfriend at the time. Hey, I'm waiting for God to pay me, man. Porque ha sido a mm. bad week. I did something so good, and that week was terrible. And like two months ago, in Dollar City and Las Cascadas, when we were leaving, mm -mm. in in the cart, my wife found a wallet. This person was crazy, man. This woman, she had like two hundred dollars. She had every every credit card i can imagine she even had the black card she had documents from tennessee i mean she was from the united states obviously yeah oh so she was from here but from the states and when i saw that i'm okay like, to me she's like no 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 wait that's a lot of no no I, because no, I was, no, oh. no, I yeah i said no i, don't <laughs> I, I remember that yes and then my wife, no, David, you have, to, okay, but I'm not going to give it to the security guard. Here, let's count the money. And I started counting the money. Maybe, see, my wife, maybe she would tell me, mira, pero no podemos quedar con el dinero. Maybe she'll learn her lesson, pero que puercas, nothing. So I counted the money and then I went and, and I spoke with the uh, sec uh, with the manager of, of Dollar City and I asked her, look, there's 200 something dollars here i come on set credit cards and some paperwork from the united states i'm going to give you my phone number can you please tell that person to call me when when they come and get it solo para meterle presión you know the, mm. the management you know well, hey man if i didn't keep anything you don't keep anything <laughs> yeah yeah so when i got home maybe like 20 minutes later she called me the lady Wow. But listen to this. She called me. Hi, are you David? Yes. Oh, hi. I, I'm, I'm the person from the wallet. Yeah. Mire usted acá al rato la anda perdiendo, perdiendo. Gracias, oye. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm happy. I Thank you. <laughs> that's it. Like, oh, oops. <laughs> oops, I needed the game. <laughs> yeah. My brother, he found an iPhone and... and, and he found an iPhone in, in an airplane, but he was going from Miami to California. I don't know. And then they called him and my, my brother answered, hi. Oh my God, you have my iPhone? Yes, I have it. Please tell me where to send it to. So, you know, my brother, he FedEx. You know what that person did? He sent them like a, a restaurant tickets. Mm. Like a, a gift certificate That's for Sizzlers. That was good, you know, like, hey, yeah, thank you very right. much. 
Look, I would like to, y como hoy todo es by phone, mm -hmm. like to any sizzler, and my brother, oh, good, so he invited his wife. I was, you know, this lady, mire, si quiere darme su dirección, le voy a mandar Don Pollo, at least. <laughs> <laughs> but nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Unos choris no quiere. <laughs> hey, 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 yeah. you can explain something about use only, you use conditional e or unless that we have a problem with some protection, another section, uh, you have to have problem with, with do, yeah, I'm putting in the chat some, the, some sentence that we have problem. Okay, well, okay, yes, no problem, we will do that. We will do that, but just remember one thing, the platform is the platform. Sometimes you can have it right, but maybe, it's a period or something that could be wrong. Okay, what is your question? What don't you understand? That the use, but because I'm trying to a different kind the of- The use of what? Yeah, they have a, the, the section and in, in that the, the answer if in the section 3.8 that the, the sentences of 5.1 and 8.1. Wait, three, but you're way three, ahead. Three, point eight. Three point eight. Yes. Okay, we'll do it. We'll do it real quick. We'll do it. We'll get there. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, we'll get there. We'll get there. Watch. Let's do the listening exercise. Oh yeah, Aaron wanted to keep the wallet. Yeah. We did this. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. No, this one we haven't done, right? Yeah. No, that is, I don't. That yeah, not problem. No, but, but I know you guys did this, but let's do this one real quick. And this is 3.3. Sorry? We are working in order. Yes. Yeah. Yes, of course. It's easy anyway, so let's do it real quick. Yes. Talking about finding something. Are these statements true or false? Or does the person not say? Check the correct answer. One, Aaron. I was with my son at the supermarket. He was about eight years old at the time, and he found a wallet on the floor. Inside it was a hundred dollar bill. A hundred dollars! He picked it up and got all excited. In fact, neither of us could really believe it. He started talking about all the things he would buy. Right away I told him that we couldn't keep it. He seemed disappointed at first. We started asking people if they had lost anything. After asking around for a while, we hadn't found anyone, and I was beginning to think we'd asked everyone. But then, as we were walking to the front of the store, I noticed a man, actually my son noticed him, pacing back and forth, shaking his head and muttering something. I thought it was probably his wallet, so we asked him, and it was. My son felt better when he saw how relieved the man was about getting his money back. That was our good deed for the day, and the man gave my son $10 as a reward for returning the wallet. 2. Leanne I was on a train from Washington to New York last month when I found a book lying under my seat. It was so strange. It was just a little book, not an expensive one. It was probably only worth a few dollars. Well, I really wanted to read it. It was pretty interesting, and by the end of the trip, I was still reading it, so I decided to keep it. I took it home and finished it. Now, every time I see it on my bookshelf, I wonder if I should have taken it or not. I mean, do you think I should have returned it to the train conductor? Who knows? Like I said, it wasn't a very expensive book, so I didn't really feel guilty about taking it. All right, so number one is what? True. Aaron's son, what? True. It's, it's true. It's true. It's true. Yeah, true. So Aaron's son wanted to keep the money. Yeah. Yes. Number two, Aaron's son received a thank you card as a reward. False. 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 What did he receive, Ricardo? 
$10. She received $10 from the man. Yes. The owner of the book probably didn't care much about it. Doesn't say. Yeah, it doesn't really say. It doesn't say. Okay. Leanne, Leanne will probably return the book. False. 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 Yeah, it's false. All right. Lesson objective. Let's see the video here. Oh, the lesson objective is able to practice and use vocabulary to talk about ethics. So let's listen to the video. Hi, are you ready to learn new words? Notice how they change their meaning with some prefixes. Prefixes. Listen to the following words, then listen again and notice how they change in meaning when using a prefix. You may make a chart in your notebook and copy the new word. Acceptable, agreeable, approving, ethical, fair, honest, legal, logical, rational, responsible, scrupulous, trustworthy. unacceptable, disagreeable, disapproving, unethical, unfair, dishonest, illegal, illogical, irrational, irresponsible, unscrupulous, untrustworthy. Use the vocabulary words to answer these questions. Number one, would you ever make an international call from your work to save money? Number two, would you ever play a practical joke on your friends? Hey, would you ever make an international call from your work? Yeah. No. But you know, now you don't really need to, right? I mean, with FaceTime and WhatsApp and everything. Oh, an international call with operator. Yeah, you know, like sometimes before people would take advantage and, oh my God, I got the um, the work office phone and you start calling all your family in the United States. You mm. know? And you know, <laughs> but now it's like, you just WhatsApp them. Yeah. All right, so let me see. It says, by the end of this section, participants will be able to practice, uh, will be able to practice using language to express wishes and regrets. Regrets. Are you ready to express wishes and regrets? Remember, we can wish about the present and the future and we regret about the past. Wishes and regrets. For wishes about the present and future, use wish plus past simple or past continuous, or could, or would, plus verb. I wish I had enough nerve to ask for a promotion. I wish I could find the time to do volunteer work. For regrets about the past, use wish plus past perfect. I wish I'd taken a few Spanish classes. I wish I had given my parents such a hard time when I was growing up. For regrets about the past, use if plus past perfect and could or would have plus past participle. If I had stuck with something, I could have gotten good at it. For strong wishes about the present or future, or for strong regrets about the past, use if only. If only clauses are often used without a main clause. If only my boss would consider promoting me. In English, there are different ways to express wishes in the present and in the future. We may use wish plus past simple, wish plus past continuous, 
wish plus could plus a verb or wish plus would plus a verb. We use wish plus past simple to express that we want a situation in the present or future to be different. Example, I wish I spoke English. I don't speak English. I wish I had a big car. I don't have a big car. I wish I were on a beach. I am in the office. Future. I wish it were the weekend tomorrow. It's only Tuesday tomorrow. Did you notice the use of were when using the pronoun I and it? This change also happens with he and she. This only happens in wishful thinking or hypothetical situations. We use wish plus past continuous to express that we want to be doing a different action in the present or the future. For example, I wish I were laying on a hammock now. I'm sitting in the office. I wish it weren't raining. It is raining. We use wish plus past perfect to express a regret or that we want a situation in the past to be different. I wish I hadn't spent too much money. I spend lots of money. They wish they had stayed in Japan. They didn't stay in Japan. We use if plus past perfect plus could have or would have plus past participle to express regrets about the past or when we want to imagine changing something in the past. For example, if she had gone to university, she could have studied French. She didn't go to university. DJ David. <laughs> You're in mute. You're in mute. Thank you. ¿Cómo están? <laughs> okay, look, th this part is real cool. Look. Wishes about the present and future. Use wish plus past participle. So I wish I had. I wish I could find time to do volunteer work. Okay, what is something you wish right now? This is called wishful thinking. Um, what is something about what is wishful thinking? This is something you want right now in the present time in the future. It says for wishes about the present and future. What is something you wish right now? I wish I had money. Money. <laughs> yeah, always. <laughs> A big, Me too. big house. <laughs> I wish I had wish a big I house. Had a big house. Uh -huh. I wish you were here. Uh -huh. Yeah. How I <laughs> wish. How I wish you were here. <laughs> that's one of the. Pink Floyd. That's one of the greatest songs ever. Yeah. Um, so I wish I could, but I can't. So I won't. No. Okay. So okay. every time. Okay, and this could sound a little strange, but I know it's present, and I know, for example, had is past, but when you say, I wish I had, it's wishful thinking because you don't have. Yes? So, I wish I had money. I wish I had, I had vacations. I wish I had, I wish I had air conditioning in my house, like Ricardo. Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> like, look at Ricardo's beach house right there. Yeah. Yes. I wish <laughs> I had a better car. What is something you wish, Gary? Uh, I wish I had a better car. 
All right. And you, Yanita? You too, huh? A better car? True. Yes, I wish I had a new car. I had. I wish I had. Yes, and pass. Or I wish I stopped hitting the 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 gate. El portón. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had a new a new portón. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Uh, Yanira, um, excuse me, do you have a boyfriend? No. Oh, okay. Because you know how like sometimes, oh baby, que pasó? I hit el portón. Que, what? Oh my God. Mm -hmm. Because yeah, you know, some men take it very seriously. I hit the car. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> it is it, it, happened, it happened to me when I, when I, when I was driving with my, with my boyfriend, I hit the car again that the portón, I don't know how to say the gate, the gate, the, gate. the, the my church gate, and he oh, said, oh, oh, no, stop, stop. He was very nervous with me. Of course, um, <laughs> Nita has a problem with the gate. <laughs> what, what did you tell <laughs> the church? You <laughs> say the gates. You also lo pague. They don't say <laughs> it's <laughs> <not> <laughs> to me. <laughs> so I have a question. Um, Portón is like gate, but what 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 is the meaning of door yard? Door yard. Can you give me that in a sentence? Um, I I heard that word in in a in a movie a few time a few years ago. Um, it it was just like a I don't remember the context. It was just like a a word that called my attention. Uh, door yard, but I don't know. It is like a. Or yeah, something. because if 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 anything, it should be yard door. But I never heard your dard. Door, 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 but door. I will look into that today because I never heard yard. I think maybe it's, it's a maybe it's an old English. I don't know because it was like a a title of a, a book in in the movie, all right? But oh, okay. I so maybe know. it could be a, it could be the name of a of a city, of a town, of a could be of a place. Could be. Maybe uh, okay. I, I don't I don't remember the country. Yeah. So I just yeah. remember gate, the word. Gate is inclusive when 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 in the airport. The gate, airport yeah. gate, uh -huh. You know, the like gate, gate yeah. one, gate two. Gate is something big. Like uh, people the, say, the, heaven, the gates of heaven. The, the doors, la, the la, gates la of puerta de, la puerta de embarque, no? Uh huh. Gate. So it's a big. Or uh, because really the garage, el portón, you can't the say it's a door. So you say, can you please open the gate? Yeah, so you, right. you need a, you hit, you stop hitting. I wish I stopped hitting gates. Uh, okay. <laughs> now, okay, uh, so remember, so when everything, anything present or future, you use wish in the simple past. Yes, or past okay. continuous, or could I, would I, okay? So I wish I ate, I wish I ate and never get fat. Absolutely. Yes, I wish I drank one beer and get drunk, but no. no. <laughs> but that never happens, I have to drink no. 20. <laughs> yes. No, I, I'm, I'm speaking about economy. <laughs> No, I wish I, I drank only one beer and the beer is is cold forever and it never it never finishes. Wow. Okay, now regrets about the past. Now this this obviously you cannot regret something in the future because it's impossible. So yeah. this is regrets about the past. So when we say regrets about the past, we use the past perfect. So we use the auxiliary. Present perfect, remember, is I have eaten. So mm -hmm. past perfect is the past of have is I had. I had. Yes. Had. Uh, I remember one time in my near my house. Uh, oh, no, when Guns N' Roses came to El Salvador, I didn't go. And I wish, I wish I had gone. When that's a rose. 
o en Axel sí. Rose King? Con Axel well, Rose King, yeah. No, but uh, también vino Gilby Clark, I think, and he was original from the Guns N' Roses. All right. But anyways, I wish I had gone because I heard the concert was good. It was. Oh, you went? Yeah, I went. Even oh, though man. the concert begin, began, began, began at 1 a.m. Really? Oh, man. Yeah, it finished, yeah, it finished like 2.30. And I have to be up for work at six next day <laughs> oh <laughs> because it was Sunday to Monday. <laughs> but so it was hard. it was a great experience though. Yeah, it was. Absolutely. Yeah. I remember I read the next day the Twitter. Axel, he actually spoke good. He says El Salvador was great. The, yesterday it was crazy. It was like the the Coliseum Puso, like the Roman the the Coliseum, great crowd, El Salvador. He actually spoke good. Uh, yeah, and, and Axel good. doesn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and he yeah. sang really good. I heard, I heard. He, yeah, I wish I had gone. So that means I didn't, and I regret it. But listen, <laughs> I, I, no digo, I wish I went. If I say I wish I went, ironicamente, I'm speaking about the future. Okay. So in this oh, case, yeah. it's the past. I wish I had gone. Can you tell me about a past regret? Anybody? I wish I had. You know, a lot of people use past regrets um, when somebody dies. I wish I had to spend more time with exactly. my father, for example. Exactly. Good example. I wish I had spent. 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 Because, because, yes, because remember, it's past, uh, past perfect. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, so I wish I had spent more time with my father. I wish I had. I wish I had told you. I loved you more often. Uh, I'm sorry, David. I, I, I have to go because I have a meeting uh, in one minute. So Is that an example or, or you really have to go? <laughs> no, no, no. I I'm really just... have to go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Bye -bye. Cool. I wish I could stay by this. Year. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, that, that's a past regret. I wish I had. And then the verb in regret, yes? For example, in this case, Yanira, it can be negative. I wish I hadn't hit, hit the gate. gate. Hit the gate. <laughs> what hurt you most? The gate or your car? Mm, I don't know. Um, <laughs> the car, man. Both. <laughs> the car. <laughs> no, that really hurts. Um, Sunday, I was washing my car, and then suddenly, you know, where's my son? My son, you know, he's at that point that everything I do, he does. And then suddenly, I see him with a spray that I have in the garage, but that spray has bleach, lejia. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And I do that because when I take out the garbage, I put bleach on the garbage so the cats don't eat it. And then I see my son putting bleach on the car. Look, that mm -hmm. papa. I, ah! <laughs> but then I couldn't I couldn't say anything because my son he was helping me. He wanted to he wanted yeah. to be like his father. But oh my god, I spent two hours like washing my car and then polishing it. Yeah. So <laughs> I wish I had I wish I had well now I do though. I wish I had put the bleach on top. Which now I did. You know, um, you know, Kari, I went to a Nirvana concert, and um, when I went to the Nirvana concert, I actually mm -hmm. escaped. I escaped from my house, and and I have a scar because my mother hit me. I was, <laughs> I was twelve, twelve, I think. But my 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 other cousins, they didn't take the risk. They say, no, no, no. And I said, no, man, I'm going, I'm going, and I'm going. And we took a train. It was like an hour and a half from where I live. We took a train and everything, and we were in the concert, and we were like, yeah, metros from Kurt Cobain. Yeah. And um, yeah, it, that concert is in, is in YouTube. And really? 
Yeah, yeah, it was, it was a very good mm -hmm. concert. And maybe you're appearing there. Yeah. Oh, man, it's, no, but you know, I, I remember that I, I was going to suffocate because I everybody was jumping and I actually jumped to get air. <laughs> but um, so every time I see my scar, because my mother threw a shoe at me, like, ah. But my cousins <laughs> always tell me, man, I wish I had gone. I would because Kurt Cobain died like six months later, I think. Oh. And then and then my 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 cousins say, Man, I wish I had gone. I wish I had gone. Because they were I, I like Nirvana, but my cousins were very big Nirvana fans. That's I was more true. Pearl Jam, but my, they were extremely big Nirvana fans. And they are now. So I always send them a video. There's a concierto, you know, like. Oh, uh, I wish you had been there. <laughs> <laughs> That's very rare. Yeah. yeah, it's like, so I wish I had gone. They always tell me, man, I wish I had gone. I wish I, wish I had gone. So uh, do you understand the difference between um, when we speak about a, w a wishful thinking in the future and a regret in the past? Yes. Yeah. All right, cool. Yes. All right, now let's go. Let's move on to where Jaime I think this was you, right, Jaime? This was your question, the knowledge check. Instructions, it says, rewrite these statements using the words in parentheses. Remember to use capital letters and periods. I can't find time to exercise. So this is present, right? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So obviously, this is going to be wishful thinking. Yeah. So... If we say I wish, I wish I, I could find I the way to find, exercise. I could find the, find time, the time to time exercise. To exercise. Yeah. Yes. I wish I could. I wish I could find the time to exercise. You know what? I'm gonna do yes. this. Hold on. So instead it's of writing is the number the number five and the number eight. Please. Okay. <laughs> We got all <laughs> wrong that one. Yes. <laughs> okay, it says, my yes. grades weren't very good last semester. If only my grades had been better last semester. I don't know how to dance well. Answer, I wish I knew how to dance well. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Um, this I don't worry about anymore because I'm married. <laughs> But when I was 20 and I was forced to dance merengue or, or salsa because, you know, you have to. If not, you don't get chicks. Yeah. Number four, I didn't apply for that interesting job at work. What do you think is I, the answer? I wish I had applied. I wish I had applied. I wish I had applied. Good. Number that five. Job at work. Yeah, fine. Yeah, fine. <laughs> <laughs> I am feeling very stressed these days. These days. What yeah, did you guys I put? Very stressed these days. I wish I what? Hadn't felt. I I wearing I wearing feel, feeling. Yeah, I wouldn't feel. Yes, I would say that. I wish I weren't feeling. Feeling, uh huh. Yeah, but the part of myself. But I weren't feeling. Man, this for the soul. Oh my I, I, I put in, I, I put in oh. that, 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 that the appear that, that incorrect <laughs> at the platform. Yes, it is so, so. <laughs> Don't feel bad. Don't feel bad because really, I mean, you guys were right. Just because you didn't put so, that's optional. Yeah, now I have the, a question. Yeah, the so part is optional. It's not grammatical, okay? So, it would have been wrong if you put, I wish I weren't feel. Okay, yeah, that's wrong. But here you can say, I wish I weren't feeling so We're stressed or very stressed. stressed. Okay. Very stressed. Only so. Stressed. Yes. Or yeah. very stressed. That was I mean, the little detail. So. <laughs> yeah. You know, for me, um, that, that should have... Uh, oh, well. We have a Someday, thing with Barry, okay? Yeah. Someday I will find the person who does this platform. <laughs> Number six, I never learned how to swim when I was a child. If only I had learned. If only I had learned. If only I had learned. Yeah. How to swim. I had yeah. learned. If only I had learned how to swim when I was a child. 
Why was that one wrong? Hmm? No, it wasn't that one. No, that's good. The other one oh, no. is no. eight. 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 Okay, I gave away all my CDs and DVDs last summer. If I, I only I, I hadn't, hadn't given, given, I haven't given away, I haven't given away, away all my old CDs and see that we didn't Yes. Yeah. Okay. If only I hadn't given away all my CDs and DVDs last summer. Good. Yeah. I still have one of my favorite DVDs here. Look. <laughs> but I don't have a, I, I don't have a DVD. Hey, Nacho Libre. I love Nacho this movie. Man. I it's don't so, like I know every verse in this movie. Get that corn out of my face. <laughs> it, it's so stupid, this movie, but I love it so much, man. Have you seen this movie? Yes. Yes. It's awesome. I, I recommend you, man. You should. Jack Black is in this movie. He's awesome. Encarnacion. <laughs> Encarnacion is Paz Vega, right? Yes. Remember when he went to the wilderness? Yeah. And then they asked, How did you find me, Chancho? We saw <laughs> you from the village. He was like, Holy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but I love that movie. I wish I had a DVD player because I don't have a DVD player, so I can't watch it. But I love this movie so much, I actually bought it original. Mm -hmm. All right, so uh, number eight. Number eight. Mm -hmm. I watched too much TV and didn't read enough when I was a, a kid. If only, if only, if only I had, if only I, I hadn't. I hadn't watched it. Watch too. Too much to be bad now. If mm -hmm. we have, you have to omit two or what? And I had read read more. Okay, mm -hmm. this is what I would put. Really, I promise you, I haven't done this, so this is new for me. It says, "I watched too much TV and didn't read enough when I was a kid. If only I." If only I didn't watch so much TV and read more when I was a, a kid. Mm -hmm. Or it, no, actually it would be, if only I hadn't watched so much TV and read more when I was a kid. So yeah, I, I would put my, I would bet for this. If only I hadn't watched so much TV and read more. No, if only I hadn't watched so much TV when I was a kid and read and read more. I would watch it so much. And I had read more when I okay, yeah. Okay, the two for so, so much. much. Okay, again, this is optional. No, not for the platform. Yeah, not for the platform. Mm -hmm. Yeah, not for the platform. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, you see, in, 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 instead of enough, it's uh, so much. So much. <laughs> yeah, but you yeah, know, it could have been so much, very much, too much. You or have just to much. write television, not TV. Mm. Oh, yeah, and television. Have to read more. Can you imagine that? You have to write. Mm. Oh, God. Television. Don't feel bad. I had read. read more. I had so much. So much <gasps> television. Television. Wow. Uh, you have to put television, you have to write television. Yeah. Ah, but the, wow. the, the plan for uh, putting that television, yeah. you put the TV, entire yeah, world. Is, is they made wrong. <laughs> yeah. Let me share it. Only I can, only the I problem can. is whoever makes this platform only lives so one possible so format. So that really sucks. So much television. No. When I want. Tienes que adivinarle a esta plataforma, no? Yeah. Okay. More. If I had it watched Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And read had more. Read, uh, more. Read, read more. And had yeah. read more. And had read, and had read, read more. Read more when I was a kid. Yeah, because read, that's that's the yeah. that's the form on the past way also the mm -hmm. past perfect read. Okay. Okay. Twenty to twenty. Okay. Yeah. Finally. <laughs> okay. We can sleep. <laughs> No, you know what? Don't worry because <laughs> where the mistake you were was optional. So your yeah. mistake was not grammatical. It was like 
it was a different way of saying it. So don't uh, you did good anyway. So good job. Okay, class. I'll see you tomorrow. We'll finish. Hopefully, we'll finish the, the lesson tomorrow. Everything. Okay. So Monday, Tuesday, yeah. we just do a full review. Okay. Okay. Thank, Thank you very you. much. You have a great day. Thank you. Thank you. Bye -bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.